Welcome to our lecture online. Now we're going to take a look at the different types of angles that we could encounter. And angles end up being classified among one of four types. We have acute angles, right angles, obtuse angles, and straight angles. Also, for our benefit, sometimes we can indicate that an angle only has one letter associated with it, which would be the point of the vertex. So this would be the vertex point A, and so we can classify an angle by its vertex point A. So here we have the four different angles. This is an acute angle, a right angle, an obtuse angle, and a straight angle. Notice something peculiar about the right angle. We have a little symbol here where we draw a line parallel to this ray and a line parallel to this way, making a little box there. That box has an indication that that angle is equal to 90 degrees. And therefore, this is called a right angle when the measure of the angle equals 90 degrees. And that's why we indicate right here, the measure of the angle A is equal to 90 degrees. That makes that a right angle. Now, what happens if the angle is less than 90 degrees, but greater than zero degrees? If the angle is zero degrees, you don't have an angle. So if the measure of the angle is between zero degrees and 90 degrees, it's called an acute angle. And if the measure is greater than 90 degrees, but less than 180 degrees, it's called an obtuse angle. And then in the one special case where the angle is exactly 180 degrees, they call that a straight angle. So therefore, we see that the two rays are opposite rays, and the angle in between the two rays, well, either direction you're going to measure the angle, you're going to end up at an angle of 180 degrees. So we have acute, right, obtuse, and straight angles, depending upon the measure of the angle. And that's how it's done.